Hey fellow riders and motorcycle enthusiasts, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the world of two-wheel legends, and our spotlight is on none other than the iconic Kawasaki Eliminator. Whether you're a seasoned rider or just getting started, this video is your go-to source for all things Kawasaki Eliminator. From its sleek design to the powerhouse beneath the hood, we've got the inside scoop on what makes this cruiser a standout in the world of motorcycles. So, if you're revved up and ready to roll, buckle up as we take a deep dive into the thrilling world of Kawasaki Eliminator. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more motorcycle content, and let's kick things into high gear. Market research shows that many motorcycle sales are won and lost on the dealership floor. New and beginning riders value two things more than any other, engine size and seat height. Kawasaki found that entry-level riders prefer 500cc and below. Understanding that research and realizing a gap in its model lineup below the Vulcan S, Kawasaki reintroduced the Eliminator badge as a lightweight cruiser. Kawasaki's 2024 Eliminator can be described as a mix between a standard and a cruiser. Derived from the Ninja 400 and Z400 street bikes, the new Eliminator utilizes the same engine, but with a larger displacement of 400 1cc. The parallel twin engine found in the Eliminator has the same bore, 70.e mm, as its sporty siblings, but with a 6.8 knee larger stroke, 58.6 m, for increased low end torque. Its steel trellis frame is inspired by the Ninja 400 platform, but has revisions to achieve a 28.9-inch seat height and a 59.8-inch wheelbase, giving the Eliminator its cruiser stance. When the Kawasaki Eliminator was originally introduced in 1985, it was a large displacement power cruiser, a drag bike. Now, the Eliminator name returns as an entry-level, easy rider cruiser. Just ride. That's Kawasaki's motto with the 2024 Eliminator. Designed with beginner-friendly features such as a manageable engine, low seat height, agile chassis, and a neutral rider triangle, the Eliminator is aimed to be one of the easiest riding motorcycles on the market. Although labeled as new rider friendly, it has enough charm to please experienced riders as well. The 4551cc parallel twin utilizes a downdraft intake in a space under the seat to improve cylinder filling efficiency. Intake funnels on the 5.8L airbox have different heights to tune out torque valleys throughout the RPM range for smooth engine response. A lightweight flywheel enables the engine to rev quickly, and the exhaust system is designed for low to mid-range power. The Eliminator's six-speed transmission has closed gear ratios for optimized power delivery, with a final gear ratio of 4314. Further adding to the Eliminator's ease of use is an assist and slipper clutch which provides a super light lever pull and prevents the rear tier from hopping during excessive engine braking. In an effort to reduce weight, Kawasaki utilizes the engine as a stressed member. The square tube construction swing arm mounts to a die cast aluminum plate that is bolted to the back of the motor. A non-adjustable 41 mm telescopic fork offers 4.7 inches of travel, while twin shocks with preload adjustment provide 3.1 inches of travel in the rear. The braking system utilizes a 310mm disc with a dual piston caliper up front and a 220mm disc and single piston caliper slows the rear. The 2024 Kawasaki Eliminator is available without ABS for 6,649s with ABS for 6,149 and the upscale SE model is only available with ABS for 7,249s. Emphasizing the Eliminator's cruiser looks is a stretched gas tank with a fuel capacity of 3.4 gallons and a pair of 10-spoke wheels. Where the rubber meets the road, the Eliminator features an 18-inch front and 16-inch rear wheel sizes wrapped in IRC Grand High Speed GS23F tires. Maintaining a strong balance between form and function, the Eliminator features full LED lighting a digital instrument panel with a gear position indicator, and has Bluetooth connectivity through the Kawasaki Rideology app, which allows riders to check vehicle information, record their routes via GPS, and receive phone notifications. Swinging a leg over the Kawasaki Eliminator for the first time, what's instantly apparent is just how manageable this motorcycle is. The 28.9-inch seat height gives confidence, knowing it is easy to keep the bike upright at a stop, regardless of the surface beneath. With an inseam of 28 inches, I find there are very few motorcycles that allow me to plant both feet flat on the ground. This is one of them. 
Rolling away from a stop is easy and repeatable with the help of the assist and slipper clutch. The tractable engine ensures the bike won't get away from the rider, but is lively enough to make the ride exciting. Cruising down Pacific Coast Highway in Oceanside, California, the low-end power provides enough torque to lug the bike at 3,000 RPM and short shift it from one light to the next. It can easily pull away from a stop in second gear without abusing the clutch or risk stalling. Plus, the engine can carry fifth gear at 25 mph pH comfortably. The 4.5 CQ Parallel Twin has just enough chuggability to act like a cruiser around town, but can equally perform in the upper RPM range on back roads and highways like a standard. Power delivery is extremely smooth and predictable. Utilizing throttle by wire, the system is precise and intuitive. Even the tiniest throttle adjustments are reciprocated at the rear wheel. In the twisties, it's evident this bike is derived from a Ninja 400. Rev the eliminator out high into the RPM range, and it continues to put the power down. Its quick revving nature makes the bike sporty and willing to attack corners. Neutral ergonomics further enhance its agile chassis on twisty pavement. But, because of a low stance, ground clearance becomes an issue if the eliminator is leaned too far over. The eliminator has a claimed curb weight of 390 pounds, SE ABS model, but feels even lighter in motion. Cutting through traffic or carving up back roads, the 2024 Kawasaki Eliminator requires minimal handlebar input to initiate lean angle and stays planted and controlled on the side of the tire. Suspension is balanced and offers the perfect combination of comfort and performance. At my weight of 125 pounds, the suspension components manage to absorb the bumps and holes on the road while still providing plenty of holdup on fast corners or under hard braking. Of course, a large bump or crater can get the bike unsettled, but let's remember, this is a cruiser, and not once, despite a few large imperfections on the surfaces traveled, did the twin shocks bottom out. Hopping back and forth from urban landscapes to winding back roads, the Kawasaki Eliminator's performance remains constant. The only component that shows any weakness in the twisties is the front brake. Getting a little too ambitious on the binders coming into corners reminds you that this is a cruiser. Leave plenty of space to slow down and flow from corner to corner. The brakes provided ample stopping distance at slower speeds. Banging gears up and down on back roads was a good test of the six-speed transmission. The gearbox is exceptional. A very short throw enhances the riding experience when shifting up or down, and the eliminator seamlessly goes from one gear to the next, without any stickiness or resistance. The Kawasaki Eliminator's transmission features an easy neutral finder system that does not allow the bike to shift from first to second at a stop. This makes putting the bike in neutral at a stop effortless without fail, and is something beginners will adore and experienced riders will appreciate. The Kawasaki Eliminator SE builds on the standard Eliminator with candy steel furnace orange ebony two-tone paint, a color-matched headlight cowl, a two-pattern stitched seat, fork boots, and a waterproof USB-C outlet. The 2024 Kawasaki Eliminator SE 7049 is only available with ABS. Kawasaki took its already existing Ninja 400 and Z400 street bike platform and reworked it for customers wanting cruiser styling while infusing new rider approachability. As the 2024 Kawasaki Eliminator enters the market, it is sure to compete with models such as the Honda Rebel 500 and Royal Enfield Meteor 350. Its flexible engine, agile chassis, approachable seat height, and accessible price point make the Eliminator a strong contender in the lightweight cruiser class. This is it for today's video. What do you think of our video? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more future updates. Thanks for watching.